Hi everyone, it is Sandra. Welcome back to my channel. Today is another planning video, of course, in my Erin Condren Horizontal. And it's just going to be my Erin Condren today because my bullet journal was included with my November bullet journal setup. I will link that video if you're curious. Today is the 30th. Not only is it my sister's birthday, so happy birthday, Melissa. Yes, this video isn't going out till Sunday, so it will be another belated happy birthday. Tomorrow is also Halloween, and then and Sunday is fall back. So daylight savings time is ending, and we get to save another hour, which means I get to sleep another hour. So I'm very excited about that. And also a quick shout out to my son because he had his quiz today. I'm so very proud of him. He got 9 out of 10 on his spelling quiz. I just had to say that. I'm so excited. And I am not hopped up on energy drinks at all, so no, not me. Okay, anyway, let's get to the planning of this video. I picked out some washi tapes. These are from Simply Gilded. Beautiful as always. We're going to go with a pink theme this week. And I'm just going to get started. I'll be using some possibly Erin Condren stickers, my Chrissy Ann Design stickers, and some Happy Planner stickers like usual. Let's get started with the whiteout and the washi tape.
So that is it for my happy planner here and we're just going to quickly talk about this. So the one pen that I used to um, write the days was this Pentel Touch Few Day uh, brush pen. This is one of the new colors. I just thought maybe I'd make some use of it because it actually kind of goes with this theme. So um, <laughs> and at the end I kind of just added tons of stickers to decorate and I feel like it kind of is all over the place but it's kind of cute at the same time and I like it. And we'll start with this Sunday. So Sunday, uh, daylight savings time ends. So technically, you know, it's like two, three o'clock in the morning. So that will happen while we're sleeping Saturday night. Um, I just put a reminder for myself to do Danny's six month spread because she will be six months on this day. It's her six month birthday. <laughs> and I like to kind of keep this like large E4 dingbat size notebook for all of my updates for her and for my son and all that. Um, a note for myself also to start working on my Procreate functional stickers. So I was thinking, honestly, I think it makes more sense if I'm going to release any stickers, whether it's on Patreon or um, Etsy or whatever the case is, it makes more sense to start with functional stickers. So the ones I like to use in my planner, either the boxes like this, which I'll be using in my actual um, happy planner that I have Franken planned or like even garbage stickers, movie night stickers, like that kind of thing. And just make them like how I like them and then go from there. So I'm going to start doing that, do some laundry. We're going to have spaghetti and look at the temperature. Like it is November 1st, you guys look at this temperature. That is like California weather. Like it is ridiculous. California freaking weather, November 2nd. Like I am blown away. My mind is blown. So Monday, I'm going to be posting my makeup tutorial on, I guess it's kind of like a get ready with me for my niece's birthday and work more on my custom bullet journal. So I will be actually doing a flip through this week or next week. I'm not sure exactly when, but whenever I finish it, I'm going to film the flip through and then I'm going to like the day I post that video is the day that the entry will go live and it will be a giveaway for January 1st. It'll be like my Christmas present to you guys. So it'll be a giveaway and I will let you know when it closes and we'll give instructions in the video from there. So some decoration sticker and also to go grocery shopping on the Monday because my son has school. And it'll be 19 freaking degrees. I am so surprised at that. Like, that is just nuts. We'll be having fried rice for dinner. Tuesday, I have to clean the upstairs bathroom. Again, work on my custom bullet journal, do some little laundry, and possibly have some homemade egg noodles. It's a thing. Chad likes them. I don't know. I was never into that before. Usually noodles to me meant like, mac like KD craft dinner, or it meant like spaghetti. But these are like special egg noodles that kind of taste like homemade noodles his parents made for him. So we've been kind of eating those and you have fry up some butter and onions and then pile up with ketchup and that's how he eats it. So that's what we're trying out. And then Wednesday, I'll be posting a video on these Monami color twin pens that I have. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm not really going to say much about those pens, but you'll see from the video. And Chad's days off start here. We'll be cleaning the floors. Danny's immunizations are at 1020. She just has one shot this time, so it's going to be way easier. So I'm very thankful for that. I want to cut Connor's hair again. We'll eat pierogies and garlic sausage for supper. And the days also are starting to get colder. Thursday, it's Connor's early release from school. Some laundry, garbage, and I'm going to prepare my plan with me. So that just means like 
laying out my stickers, kind of doing like a list of all the things going on during the week and make it easy for supper and have grilled cheese and chicken strips. Friday, I'm going to sticker my happy planner. So as you guys know, I think I've been talking about this a little bit. I've done a Franken planning system in my happy planner for 2021. It's all ready to go and I've filmed a video. I just have to post it and find a date to post it. But in my current happy planner, so what I do is mostly work stuff behind the scenes that I do not show on the internet, but I've also added a partial kind of like reading planner. So I basically write about everything I've read about that day. And also I've added a home planner so I can plan and organize projects around my house, re renovation projects, such like the floor and stuff, and also cleaning and my son's like school days and stuff like that. So this planner, and this will actually go for um, in July and January too. This is what I'm going to be carrying through with my process. This is my filming planner. So this is what I will share with you guys. But the other happy planner will just be kind of kept on the back burner. And that's in my spare time and just more functional planning. So it won't be as decorative. Definitely not as many stickers, if at all. And then I'll also be doing my plan with me. So I have this little planner sticker here. Um, filming the plan with me and then I'm posting a Michaels haul so that will show the planner that I'm planning on using for my Franken planner happy planner and then just a reminder that Connor has a quiz and that we need to study like this entire week and I'm going to order pizza for us that night just to give myself a break so I don't have to cook probably be a movie night and a pizza night and then Saturday I put pajama day because I'm going to stay in my jammies because I don't have to go anywhere thank goodness I love Saturdays because I can sleep in and I love these little plan. like I got this from the happy planner I can't remember the name of the pack but it's a hunt tons of these like little stick girls they're so cute I'm going to fill my date night makeup and I might use my pumpkin spice palette that I got today from Too Faced from Sephora for my date night look so then I added these Erin Condren little decoration stickers here at the bottom and I think it goes pretty good I really like pastel pink. I don't use it that often. I also prefer blue and purples, but this looks really pretty this, you know, for a change, especially for November because November is so blah and ucky. <laughs> so I like to make myself happy by looking at my planner. So that's all from me for this week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And also if you're new here, please consider subscribing because it would help me out so much. And again, stay tuned for that video that will be coming for my flip through for my custom made bullet journal that I will be giving away to you guys because I want to say thank you for subscribing and just being here with me in general, kind of, you know, going through this first zero to 1000 subscriber time with me. I'm new and I just appreciate that you clicked on that subscribe button and thank you for following and looking at my content. So. In order to know when I post any of my videos, make sure you click on that little bell notification button and we'll talk to you guys next week. I hope you have a great one. Stay safe. Bye.